Hey guys, it's Diamond Crafters here. So today I'm going to show you how to port forward your Minecraft server. Um, without uh, this, the port forwarding, uh, you won't be able to play with your with many people because you would have matchy, which would be limited to five people unless you pay, or you would just be able to play on your local network. Um, so first of all, what you would need to do is go to this icon at the top right corner um the wi-fi icon thing um then you go all the way to bottom to the bottom um and open your net oops open your network pre preferences and then you'll need to go to advanced at the bottom right oh yeah bottom right corner um then click on TPC uh, forward slash uh, dash IP. Um, then you'll find your router, the IP. Just copy paste that into your browser. Uh, go to your browser. Copy paste it. So for me, it already logged in. Uh, but for you, it wouldn't log in immediately and you will need a password and username so to find out what your password and username is go to routerpasswords.com and in here find your router and in this case mine is netgear um, here we go and then here find password um and default okay then here are the well um the the ids or the numbers of uh your router uh mine is a w uh yeah w p n eight two four which is this one so here my username would be admin, my password pa would be password. Um, next, okay, you would go here, you would log in, and you would appear in something similar to that, uh, to this page. If it is, if you don't have Netgear, it will still be quite similar, but the format won't be the same. Then you will need to find some place uh, where it says advanced, the advanced setting or something like that then go into port forwarding port triggering and here you would add a server ip address um so you will need to go back to the network preferences and find your ipv4 address which is right uh here the ipv4 address and then this address uh, the first part should be already filled in for you. Just need to add the two or three last digits. And for me, so it's 27. And I will add it, but since I already have others, I won't do that. Um, then, so should appear here, you edit the servers. You would need to uh, set the protocol to both TPC and UDP. And the starting port to 25565 and the ending port to 25562, uh, which is the default. If you don't set it to 25565, you will need to uh, go into your server pro uh, preferences and change the uh, the server port. Um, so, oh yes, and one thing I forgot to mention was uh, so that people can connect to the server. You need to just open new tab in your Windows and then type into your Google search bar uh, my IP. Then just click enter and Google should show your public IP. So this is the IP you give to your friends so that they can connect to the server. And if you set the port to something else than 25565, um, you would need to add at the end of that two dots and the port you you change if it's still 25565 just give them that and they should be able to connect to the server so thanks for watching like the video subscribe
and I'll do usual. Thank you. Okay, so I'm back. If you're still not sure how to port forward, there's this site called portforward.com. So you just type portforward.com. Then um, you find your router brand. So mine, as I said before, whoops, nope, is Netgear. Yeah. Is Netgear. So let me find Netgear right here. Then you choose your model, um, which, ugh, shoot. Uh, so, my model, if they don't have your model, choose one that's quite similar to it. And my model is, um, this one. So, next I would click just search, and it would give you a list of tutorials on had to put for your server f for um, these specific games so you would click on the M and search for Minecraft which is right here Minecraft server you click on it and it should give you um, basically all everything you need on how to do it so your password your username where it is, where exactly it is, um, how to do it, um, blah, 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 and etc. Um, so this really helps if you're still not trying to do it. And once again, thank you for watching.